Patrick and this is Brian. Together we're just got played. We're coming to you from the Cloak and Blaster and this time we're going to give you something a little different. We normally give you reviews on games, but tonight we're going to tell you a little bit about news about games. So instead of just got played, we're going to temporarily call this just got relayed. Just got relayed, relaying the information to you. So I'm going to start off. Uh, Roger Cotton is a game designer up north and he is designing a game that is superhero based, but it's a little different than everyone else's game that's out, the superhero based. This one, you're actually playing cards and building a comic book panel. Hmm. I've gotten to see some of the artwork and I've gotten to see some of the gameplay and it is really, really super cool. I'm excited about it. I'm gonna keep my eyes out for it and so should you. Okay, um, let's see. Uh, there's a couple conventions that I wanna uh, give a shout out to. There's a new one called Flamingo Con and it's in West Palm Beach area. They're trying to actually um, uh, let it take place three times a year. It's a one-day convention, um, and uh, and that's in West Palm. August 22nd, I think, is the next one. So Flamingo Con. So if you just jump online or on our website, we'll have a link to it. And uh, if you're a Floridian and you love games, you've got no excuse not to show up and uh, and try to beat me at a game. You can um, try. You can try. It's really difficult to beat him at anything. Nah. Um, another convention that's coming up uh, is brought to us by the Sup Guild out of Tampa. This one's called uh, Protocon, right? Yep. And um, it's going to actually be held in Kissimmee. And so the main focus for this uh, con is for um, prototypes. Of, um, so if you're a local, or a local game designer or uh, I guess a national game designer, if you want to bring your prototype uh, to this convention, there's going to be lots of playtesters um, and other game designers there, all giving each other feedback and helping each other just improve their games. Um, also, if you're if you want to play test the games, if you're just a gamer and you want to play the game first before anyone else, this is your con. And we're going to be at that one. We're going to do some filming. So if we see your game and we like it, we may give you a little bit of airtime on that one too. Mm -hmm. Another game that's coming out right now. Well, it's not coming out, but it's in develop right now. Is Robert Burke and Steve Avery have both joined up to make a game called Doppelganger. Now, Doppelganger is a dungeon delve, but it also has a built-in trader mechanic. Hmm. So one of the players is actually a Doppelganger, and we'll turn on the party for the end of the game. Really, really cool idea. I'm excited to hear about it. I think it plays up to six players, too. So this thing's going to be pretty cool. It's coming out. Um, speaking of Robert Burke, you're going to have Faust hitting the table pretty soon. It is shipping. So if you funded it on Kickstarter, you're going to be getting your copy soon. And if you didn't fund it, it's going to be available. Cool stuff. So look out for Faust if you haven't already already funded for that one. Uh, another game uh, called Mana Forge by uh, Brian Klein. That's going to be uh, coming to Kickstarter in the near future. And uh, another game uh, called Seven and Seven by Corey Goff is going to also be coming to Kickstarter very soon. That's the one where we did a review for it and we'll be putting the review out, but that's where you got to collect either the seven virtues or the seven deadly sins. Uh, it's a great little game. Um, and also, Patrick, you're going to be coming out with a game too, uh, Siege of Verdan, right? Yep, my game should be hitting Kickstarter sometime in September as well. Okay, great. Thank you for mentioning it. Actually. Oh, well, you're welcome. You're welcome. Well, I'm Patrick, and this is Brian, and this is Just Got Relayed. Relayed. Thanks for watching. What kind of production is this? <laughs>